Hey everybody, up for sale today, we have this 2000 <coughs> Dodge Dakota. Very special car, rare. Why is that? This is a uh, quad cab Dakota. It's a four wheel drive, wearing top of the line SLT trim. And this car has the rare and powerful 5.9 liter Magnum V8 engine. These engines were a big upgrade. It's the same engine that came in the uh, 5.9 Grand Cherokee back in the 90s. Um, Super, super fast uh, truck. Plenty of power. And the biggest offering for this truck. If you go online and try to find them, um, you probably won't find one. Um, as I mentioned, they're hard to come by. This is a one owner vehicle with a clean Carfax. It's got 49,000 original miles on it. We have all the, original, uh, all the original materials for the vehicle. Original keys. I have a remote here. Opens, closes the doors. Sounds the alarm, all that stuff. And the glove box, I had the original owner's manual, the booklets. I had the original window sticker for this vehicle. Um, we, we even had the original um, connection for the uh, towing package. Never even opened still in the bag in the glove box. That's there. The car has a uh, Lear fiberglass cap on the back with a, with a, with a Thule uh, roof rack. We have the keys for the cap. We have the keys for the roof rack. Car comes with two cans of touch-up paint. Uh, original floor mats And the vehicle is just fully fully optioned power windows locks mirrors cruise control ice cold AC um, Everything this is a really loaded up loaded up Dakota as I mentioned you're not gonna find one like this um, Probably the best one on the market in my opinion with the most options with the five nine with the uh, four-wheel drive quad cab Everything it's just uh, loaded um, We'll start it up Actually starts right up. You can see all the warning lights extinguished. There's no warning lights on of any type. It's got 49,732 miles right now. All the car's gauges work. I'm just gonna show you the uh, all the car's interior features. Not many of them in this vehicle to go through, but we'll go through everything. You can see the signals work. The hazards work. Wipers work on all speeds, of course. This car also has a valid New York State inspection sticker on the uh, window there, on the windshield. It, it did pass inspection, no problem. Horn works, car has cruise control. Okay, all the headlights and everything work. I tried it all out, it's, it's all good. Power locks work. There you go, power windows. All of them work as they should. Okay, um, power mirrors here. I haven't tried them yet. Mm -hmm, they, they work. Oh, they work great too. Up and down, left to right. Passenger as well. So it's just a great vehicle. There's no disappointments with this vehicle. Has tilt steering. The car has ice cold AC. It has hot heat. All the fan speeds work and everything. Okay. There's no problem with the climate control at all. It goes on, it goes off. Heat works, AC works. Um, no problem with any of that stuff. Radio goes on. It resembles it. Oh, this is like a really, really uh, blast from the past kind of song here. <laughs> Gee, I haven't heard that song in years. Power outlet here. Cigarette lighter never use, ashtray never use, uh, four wheel drive. Car has original mats on the floor under the uh, all weather mats here. I believe these are clean seats, no rips, no tears, no burn holes. Like I said the guy never smoked in the vehicle. Clean overhead roof liner or headliner rather. Dome lights go on as you would expect. It has a dual storage holders here. Like his sunglasses and stuff like that. There's a lear cap in the back. I'm actually have two keys for the cap, and I have two keys for the uh, roof racks over that. They move up and down on top of the cap. So you have like luggage you want to store there, and uh, we have all the keys and everything. And the glove box here. We have the original tow. I said the original towing harness still in the bag. 
the manuals, the window sticker, all that stuff. Everything is still present. Hasn't even been used. The vehicle wasn't used as a, as a work truck. The guy who uh, bought it originally, the only owner of it, um, he bought the towing package and never even towed anything with it. Why? Who knows, but he never used it uh, for towing or for work. It was just a leisure vehicle, and that was pretty much it. Um, there was garage kept. This wasn't a, a vehicle that was outside all the time. As I mentioned, 49,000 miles. It's got to be the best example of a 5.9 quad cab 4x4 um, Durango out there. I mean Durango, I'm sorry. <laughs> Dakota. Um, you won't find a better one. When I've seen these vehicles with 140,000 miles on eBay for seven or eight grand, not even in this condition. This is a premier example of one of these cars. Okay, what we're gonna do now is just uh, take it for a little test drive. Okay, so give me one second. Let me just get myself situated here. And you can see here also you put the car in reverse. She goes right in reverse. No problem. I'll put it in drive. And same thing with drive. She goes right in drive. Come to a stop sign. She stops the way that you would expect her to. Sorry about the glare today in the video. Um, it's pretty sunny out, and it's the only time of the day I have to take these uh, videos and pictures. So, if you bear with me, okay. I give it some gas now and show she really takes off. Hey, okay, come to a Come to a turn over here. I mean, if someone's looking for a really cool truck, this is it. I mean, with a 5.9 engine, this thing will basically tow anything. As I said, it has a tow package and uh, everything that you need to get started if you really want a nice, powerful truck. And I doubt you're going to find another one with 49,000 miles. That's not even owned by one person. Uh, man, it's, man, it is windy today. I'm not sure if you can hear where I'm driving, but if you hear that little kind of like whistling sound, uh, it is windy. It's sunny here, but it's about 15 degrees outside of New York, so. But all right, I think you got the picture how good this vehicle is. So as you can see, there's no lights on, dash. She comes right down the road, no problem. Come over here to a stop sign. You can see she brakes on a dime. And no noise at all with the brakes. Car steers good. Or as you know, good as you expect for a uh, pickup of its size. But uh, yeah, okay. I'll uh, cut my video off now. Any questions about the vehicle, feel free to email. Give me, give me a call. I'll be happy to address any questions you got. If you want to ship the vehicle, I have a shipper. We can set it up anywhere in the continental U.S. Um, just let us know and we'll get you a quote for that. All right. Thanks and good luck bidding.